Let's do our best combined men's and women's all time US national team. And so what we've done here in terms of the rules is we said, okay, you get 11 players, obviously. We've kind of said, let's, let's keep it with that 4-3-3. Uh, we're gonna alternate back and forth, but we're also gonna alternate. We're taking uh, women first, then men, women first, back and forth like that. Yeah, my first pick, which, which has to be a US women's player, I am going to go with Mia Hamm. My number one pick, is Tobin Heath, okay? Uh, I have had the uh, incredible privilege to actually play in a game, in multiple games with uh, Tobin Heath pickup games. And I have seen what she can do uh, and her ability. And I am going to select Eddie Pope for the center of the fence. Oh, you um, bastard. I, I felt it important to um, lock up that male center back spot because it is slim pickings there, as you know, Alexi, not a lot of good options. <laughs> Yes, it is. I mean, you know, it's it's scorched earth pretty much since the uh, mid '90s. Let's uh, let's be honest. My second pick is going to be on the other side of the field. So I'm going to have Tobin on the right hand side of that top three. I am going to have the great Landon Donovan on the left hand side. So for my next pick, I took Michelle Akers, who uh, I said earlier, Mia Hamm in the conversation for the greatest women's player of all time. I think Michelle Akers is, is there too. In fact, the Ham versus Akers, who's the greatest US women's player of all time is a really fun debate. All right, number three now, I'm going to pick Julie Ertz, okay, as one of my midfield destroyers. Okay, my next pick uh, would be Tab Ramos. Uh, a very wise colleague of mine once said of Ty Ramos, he was a man before his time. Mm -hmm. Somebody who was not a man out of time, but I am still going to pick him because I think, uh, and for those of you that, that follow him, uh, he's a wild card, but also one of the great strikers and finishers, whether it's in the, in the run of play or on free kicks. So I'm going to go with Eric Winalda as my fourth pick right up top. Eric Winalda up top. Next up for me, back to the women, I'm going to go with Becky Sauerbrunn. So I've now um, locked up my center back pairing, Eddie Pope and Becky Sauerbrunn. All right, I'm gonna go with the great Christine Lilly in my midfield, I think at times underappreciated. Um, and having said that for the amount of accolades and praise that she does get, I still think that she is under underappreciated. Okay, my next pick is Steve Cherundolo at right back. I'm gonna go with the great, and he was a great until he was cut down by injuries, uh, John O'Brien. Okay, my next pick is Carly Lloyd, who I am going to play as kind of an attacking midfielder. Like I said, we'll figure out the formation at the end, but I have her as one of my midfield three. That's my seventh pick on the left-hand side. Now I'm going to get into the defense here. Crystal Dunn, okay? Uh, you can teach all sorts of tactics and you can teach technique and all that kind of stuff but ultimately the ability to play multiple positions and as we saw this summer uh a an ability to play that left back position with her speed so my next pick uh clint dempsey uh as one of my front three all right i'm gonna go to back to my on my right hand side and what i'll call my right side of my team is kind of my my bohemian right if you will uh i'm gonna put frankie Haydick. On that, on that right back position. He's backing up Tobin Heath there. So that's an interesting right side for my uh, for my team. My next pick is Julie Foudy to complete my midfield three. I, I went back and forth as to, uh, to have a male or female goalkeeper. And what I've come down to is for my ninth pick, uh, we are picking females right now. So I'm gonna pick Hope Solo in goal. I'm gonna need her to step it up. And that's saying a lot from one, if not the greatest goalkeeper and one of the great American uh, players ever to play the game and i will go with uh tim howard with my next pick so mm -hmm. uh, i will fill my goalkeeper so we talked about the mia ham michelle Akers debate the uh, u.s men's goalkeeper three-way tim howard brad frito casey keller debate is i mean you could you know you could rank those three any which way but i went with howard i think club and country he has the slightly better overall resume than the other two i'm gonna pick carlos bocanegra long time captain and center back for the uh, men's national team. He's got that that nice left foot uh, over there on that left-hand side with, with Dunn and Landon. And I will close out my team with Kelly O'Hara at left back. Oh, okay. That's good, too. That's good, too. And I will close out my team with uh, Christy Pierce. We knew her for many, many years, and certainly when she was doing uh, you know, for the most part, when she was doing the great things, and one of the reasons why I picked her was her, her great ability. We uh, knew her as Christy Rampone. 
I started thinking about this uh, before we recorded the show last night, and I started to put down names, and then I started to get into why am I picking this person? Why am I picking this person? Does this look good? I did want to have some balance. I did want to look at a team and say that team could could compete. Uh, I didn't want to say that team was out of balance or that team was top heavy or that team isn't going to be able to defend or anything like that. So I'm happy with uh, with my 11. And hey, you know, you can uh, do this on your own. You can get with a friend and go back and forth and find out what 11 you come up with. As as you uh, you know, as you know, we're going to go back and forth. And so just because uh, we don't have an, uh, somebody in our 11 doesn't mean that we wouldn't pick them. But let us know what uh, what you would do with your 11. Tag somebody else out there and do your own type of draft. It's not as easy as it, as it sounds or as you think. You like that clip? Well, my State of the Union podcast drops every week. Subscribe now on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you get your podcasts.